This week's Odd Box is the subject of today's Food for Thought. My name is Jodie Bunting. This is a daily live health tip to help you lose some weight. Now, this time last week, I told you about my Odd Box delivery. So for those of you who don't know what Odd Boxes are, it's basically a delivery that comes to your house direct from the farm of all the wonky vegetables that are a little bit odd. And it's a box full of these treats. Um... They're basically 15 quid. This one is a large vegetable variety. You can get small, medium and large. You can get veg boxes. You can get fruit boxes. You can get fruit and veg boxes. And you can choose some items which you don't particularly like as well. I like all vegetables, so there's nothing on my do not deliver list. Uh, And after last week, I am pretty keyed up now on how to find out what items are from what. As you know, I love, love, love British produce. So let's go through some of the items. Now, straight away, you can see this week's box is very green. Very, very green. Now, last week we had some rocket. This week we've got some spinach. And it tells you in here whether to keep it in the fridge or out of the fridge. So straight away, spinach. This one is from Italy, Spain, stroke Worcestershire. (laughs) And it also gives you a reason why it's here. The reason it's in the box is because they've got way too much of it. So I don't know whether that's from Worcestershire, Spain or Italy, but I love a bit of spinach, guys. So that is the first item in the box. Then thrown in a little bit randomly is the kale. Now this, oh, that's not kale. This is kale and this is from Worcestershire. Okay, so that is Worcestershire kale and I will get this out. And that also needs to go in the fridge. Uh, What do you guys love to do with your kale? Uh, I know a lot of people like to have it in curries. Uh, Also, it goes well in frittatas and omelettes and things like that. Um, Right, the next thing, which again, I was quite a little bit miffed with last week. We got loads of this. These are spring onions and these are from Egypt. (laughs) Okay, the next item on our list is this. What is this? Does anybody know what this is? Uh, This is Spring Greens, and this is from the United Kingdom of Great Britain. Yes. So Spring Greens, you can basically just use it like you would use uh, cabbage. And obviously that is full of nutrients. A little bit more... um, A little bit more uh, kale there that I'll just throw over that side. Then tossed in the bottom here is a cauliflower. So last week week we had broccoli. This week we've got cauliflower. I love the fact that they do mix it up as well, guys, so you're not getting the same thing every week. This cauliflower is from Lincolnshire. So Lincolnshire cauliflower. Now next up, oh, I'm happy, guys. What I love when I have lots of vegetables is to dip crispy vegetables, roast vegetables, in avocado. So these are three avocados in the odd box this week. Um, And these are from Colombia. So there's no such thing as a British avocado. So it's nice. But as you can see, everything is really green. Uh, And I've got more green things. Oh. I've just noticed. I've got a fourth avocado. So that was four avocados. Uh, We were talking about price uh, last week. So what we're going to do, we'll do a quick recce in a minute to see how much you think this is worth. Uh, Next up on the list are these peppers. Uh, These are from Spain. Uh, Too many and they're too odd, apparently, as well. A little bit dark colours, maybe. And I've got one, two, three... Four, five, six. So there's six green peppers which are in this box. And again, for those of you wondering why these items are odd, stuff like that, supermarkets won't accept that. That's not a real green pepper. So Sainsbury's, for instance, would not accept that. And that's why it made it into the odd box. Then I've got two little Swedes. These are from Suffolk, which again is great. So British products. And if you have a look at them, you can see why that didn't make it, because that's literally been sliced in half, been run over by the tractor. Uh, and that one is just uh, it's lost its end or so. That's why that one's there. Uh, last week, I only had three potatoes. This week, I've got 
five potatoes in my eyeball box again one a little bit bruised uh, and again the reason being they're in there they're just a little bit out of shape so that is this week's odd box so let's just have a quick recce uh, i will probably say a pound for the potatoes another pound for the peppers let's say a pound for those because they're quite small so three uh four pound five six Seven for the spinach. Now these are quite big, so eight, nine, ten, eleven with for the kale, twelve with the cauliflower. So very much the same as last week. I would say I've probably got about twelve quids worth of stuff here with the delivery fee, which is an extra three pounds. I think it's worth fifteen quid. And as I said, most of it is British. Uh, it comes direct from the farm, uh, and most of it is in um season as well which is of course perfect uh there is our favorite recipe of the week which is included in the little leaflet and this said spring greens with mustard seeds serves for and it's uh, adapted from the bbc good food website um other information on here um just telling you obviously how we save on the environment because none of this stuff is in plastic, apart from the leaves, which are just in a bag. Everything else, as you can see, is all plastic free, which is fantastic. Uh, if you would like to order your own odd box, guys, I've tagged the Facebook page in this post. And also there, there is a link if you would like £10 off your first box. As I said, this box was 15 quid. Uh, if you use that link, you'll get £10 off. So you'll get all this veg for a fiver. It's bloody worth it, guys, just for those four avocados. Right, that's it from me. Thank you for joining me. I'll see you again next Sunday for my next odd box. It's like Christmas comes every Sunday. Bye for now.